Hello. Uh, just a very quick free ball sort of, sorry about that, um, video on if you can't afford student accommodation, you know, you need help paying it or the rent is a little bit too much. So firstly, uh, the biggest expense of any student apart from the tuition fee is their accommodation and rent. So really think about what you are or can pay for your rent. Uh, do you want to go slightly cheaper into student housing or would you like to go slightly more expensive into student accommodation which is your studios and apartments in big built uh, student blocks. If you can't afford it and you want to live there, how are you going to make up the money? That's the next thing you've got to think of. You know, um, are you going to start uh, getting a part time job, going to work in the SU, going to work as a, a waiter or a waitress in a restaurant, uh, in pubs, uh, anything like that? You know, shops, uh, you know, you could go slightly more down the adventurous route, e commerce, and all those kind of bits, but make sure that it's reliable income. That's the thing you need to think of because your rent will be due weekly, monthly, quarterly, termly, however you want to do it they will want that money and if it's not a predictable income, it might uh, get you down the wrong path of debt and then they can always evict you. So if you can't afford it, I would advise that you go for something cheaper and if you can't afford that, look at ways that you can make it affordable. So jobs, you know, yes, you will have tons of jobs, you can do that, um, you know, they'll always, they'll always ask for bar staff in their own sort of nightclubs, uh, bars, you know, everything like that make it affordable and then keep your cost of living low that's the next thing that you need to think of so after rent it's your cost of living so how much you spend on food how much you spend on activities where you spend your money and what you spend your money on then you need to start look at your budget and what you can do with that my advice on this is write down everything that you spend uh, look at where you're spending the most money can you reduce it and is it of any use to you if it's of no use to you please cross it out stop spending money on it I hope this has been useful. It's just a quick off the cuff uh, video on student accommodation and why you're not be able to afford it because it can be very expensive, especially living in a studio and apartment. However, there are ways you can afford it. You just probably have to work and, you know, and earn that money for it. If you have any questions, head over to the website, get me on WhatsApp or uh, read the article on it that I've done online. I'll see you soon.